the kitchen is my favorite. And then someone was like, of course kitchen's your favorite because you're the wife. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> okay, that's rude. That is rude. You know, say maybe elementary school. Even now when we're in America, we're aliens. I came here, I'm like, where is my wings? Sizzle on my tongue. Hopefully this is a platform that makes people feel safe. I completely almost forgot. Outcast fans, welcome! Hi everyone! It has been a while. Hold on, walking Tyler, let's let's get to these updates, shall we? Shall right. we? We shall. When is the last time we did the, an episode? I don't remember. Like together, yeah, that was like, like maybe two, at least two months before ago. Yes, but we will plan a, you know, more secure schedule of guests in the future right? yes because for now we are all focused on our first ever meet up oh my god this is exciting okay this yeah this is oh, exciting mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and then um i don't know if you guys follow us on instagram but we have reached a hundred thousand <gasps> Congratulations to us! We have never thought we would have... Dude, it was crazy. That is I remember cr- it yeah. so well that when I we know. reached 10k, we were like, imagine 100k. I remember I you know. were like, oh, what if 100k? I'm like, you're already thinking about 100k. Like, wait, all right? Like, it's like, I know it's... Of course, it's like, you think 10k, and you're like, you're like, oh my god, imagine if we did 100k. That would be crazy. Yeah. And now I'm in 100k, like I remember that moment. It's like, what? Yeah. It's possible. No, yeah. It's crazy. It's possible. People, it's possible. All right. And yeah, I can't believe we connected with uh, more than 100,000 people online. People mm-hmm. feeling online. Well, talking mm-hmm. about um, growth. All right. Uh, how's your new apartment? <laughs> I moved to a new apartment. Mm-hmm. It's, she, uh, she went from having flatmates to being yes private yes which is great, right? like a, a shared house with family friends oh. to our own place which i feel like is a big step um Amazing. you know i mean yeah dude for everybody it's like an applaud dude everybody knows that is like a huge step in life right like especially in america yeah. oh my god like the prices these that's days? true i mean still the prices isn't great here but you know we were like oh it's been too long our priority really is just to move out and have our own place um it's nice it's really nice and people come here to like wow hola <laughs> i cannot wait i cannot wait <laughs> yeah she's coming soon it. um it's a it's like a interesting like longer kind of rectangular oh, apartment wow, wow. <laughs> but like one thing i learned though i remember you know when we we're younger it's like oh tall ceilings oh that's so cool like it's really nice and my husband is also really tall so you know yeah. he loves it but it's not good for content creating because it's so echoey like i'm like where do i find a spot where it's not echoey i don't <laughs> even know it's not echoey probably not as much but uh, so yeah. Like, so yeah. note to self, guys: uh, if you're choosing an apartment and you're a content creator, don't get a high ceiling. <laughs> don't. <laughs> don't get a have... mansion. <laughs> unless you have a lot of stuff to put all over everywhere. <laughs> there you go. You guys. know. Yes, you see. Yeah. That's why, like you know, if you watch those um series where they, you know, it's like a um, pop star that has to record their uh, thing. They're oh, they always go into a, like a small like house mm-hmm. like a, or a small room. Oh, like, interesting. Why? Is that that's now maybe I, no, why? Now that I realize, because yeah, you enjoy the mansion, but you don't co- create content there. But you go to a different spot where there's it's not echoey, or you have yes. uh, what's that? Good soundproof. Acoustics. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, I don't know. It's nice. It's a big step, and the reason the, the yeah, back is so pretty. I really, this is this is my kitchen. This is maybe I'll show you a video later. But the kitchen is my favorite. And then someone was like, "Of course, kitchen's your favorite because you're the wife." I'm like, "What the fuck?" Okay, that's rude. That is you rude. Do like to cook. You do like to cook. Or I so do like, like to cook. So it's like, shut up, shut up. Stop not. being right. Yes, stop labeling me. But 
I was so excited for the kitchen. I'm not going to lie. Like, I was like, oh, the stove is like actual, you know, gas stove, not electric. Oh, yes, yes, yes. That's actually, dude, that's one thing I told Tyler. I was like, I miss an actual fire. Like, things yeah. get hot way faster, too. Like, yeah. a home is fire. Oh, my God. In Macau. Yeah. And then, and then um, I was talking, I was also talking to um, Anna from from uk mm. like the chef that we spoke to oh, you know like because i saw her story about like this brand that has really bad non-stick pans but apparently like most non-stick pans companies like no matter how expensive they are you have to replace them in a few years anyway so like might as well just get any non-stick pan and then replace it every few because it's like Anyways, they just make it so fancy, like, oh, it's so nice, I don't need oil. But what's wrong with a little oil when you fry an egg, you know? That's true. Um, the reason we're able to come here is because, yeah, like, of the new job that I got in this. Actually, tomorrow is three months already. <gasps> May 19th. Amazing, yes. Three months is perfect time to, like, also, like, get acquainted to it and um, get used to it, right? And yeah. Yeah, and I was telling um, the person I met yesterday at the event, like, oh, like, yeah, I'm in marketing, and then, you know, you're in graphic design, also marketing, and she was like, oh, that's perfect for what you guys do, like, I was like, yeah, it's true, you know, what we do on the job is what we do for our project. That's so cute! One of the greater things about living in New York, though, well, close to New York City, since New York is huge, right? You're still, like, an hour away from the city, right? Yeah, an hour, yeah, an hour away. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, like drive, yeah. but then, but then you went to a Asian uh, first uh, Asian event. A A N H P I. Oh, this is one thing. Let's discuss about because we were like in the conversation. We were like, how do you say A A N H P I? Like the whole thing. That is so long, bro. Well, just say AAPI. We yeah. know our letters. Okay. Can't these people know our letters? True. Tell us, what did you attend? To, it is called a sunset. I think the theme was sunset celebration. And it was so nice because like going in, you actually see like you know, like, um, lanterns, but the lights are very, like, red-orange, so it kind of does feel like sunset kind of vibe. Nice. And then it's funny that, like, yeah, I, I mean, it's rare that I go into a place and, like, Caucasians are minority, you know what I mean? Like, Whoa. you go in, you're like, oh. And then just, like, vendor, vendor food, like, everywhere, I guess, like, they invited a lot of the, um, Asian American like, sp like restaurants and stores like you know vendors, and it's so good, the Whoa. food. Like if we some of the places that we plan have like those shops, so I'm gonna bring you to some of their places. Yeah, I cannot wait. But it's it's good. It's it's nice and like you know thank you Christine Wong oh. and Joanne for inviting us. Awesome. Super nice, and um, yeah, just like. It's a nice vibe, you know? They did really well with event planning. And you know, event planning is not easy. Obviously it's not. It's so much to Any plan. planning. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> yeah. But like, you just go there, you know, you sample all the different food, and then there's all the drinks, there's Lunar, there's Moshi. I just finished mine. Oh my god! Have you tried this? No. Okay, you gotta try it. It's, it's really good. This is, this one is Oolong Tea White Grape Sparkling. Flavor. Long tea and yeah. white grapes. Oh my god! I saw you guys did some activities like the oh, yeah. chopsticks. That's what we did in our like ch like Children's Day, right? Yeah, and yeah. Chan or Chan Zi Wu Dong. Chan Zi Wu Dong. How did you do? I beat Juhi, and and I was told that I got seconds. I think the first one got thirty, and I got like twenty four or something. Wow. Insane. <laughs> um, nice, yeah, no. Uh, it was it was really good, and you know, like. What was the <sighs> top one food that you remember? Oh my god! Oh my god! Let me tell you. <laughs> let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Tell it to me. Let me know. <laughs> They're called Essex Pearl, and they had this toast, like a, it's like a bite-sized sample toast. It's like buttery, and then on top there's like a. a almost like a spread of like 
mayo mixed with cheese with shrimp oh, wow. and then different types of cheese and a lot of seasonings like on the bread and then on top a little bit of like like mushroom xo jang like Whoa. on the, and it and it was toasted and it was so good mm. oh my god and i'll show you the video but like that was our favorite like all of them were good but that one really stood out like it was like a perfect fusion mm. of like it felt French, but it felt Cantonese too. Oh <laughs> I'm sure. Oui, oui. Yeah, we 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 how ye? We we okay how ye? <laughs> Just recently, we are both. Oh, oh, we're both U.S. citizens now. America, we're American. Call us Americanos because we are a newly citizens. Oh my god, it's awesome! Oh. I passed mine like a few months ago, and then yes, Min just passed hers officially. So now we are real Americanos. Now when people tease us like, "Oh, those dumb Americans," we could actually say, "Yeah, oh, what are you talking about?" You know, because <laughs> we are actually Americans. Yeah, Americans now. One in New York. One in, one in Florida. Yeah, exactly. No, but USA. <laughs> and I think that's one of the first things I remember when I first met Deadly, like my husband. <laughs> he was like, USA. I'm like, oh, freaking Americans. And now <laughs> I'm an American. <laughs> we're an American, baby. We're he was an like, American. He was like, now, whenever anyone trashes trash talk on America, you gotta say, what do you mean? It's the best country in the world. Oh, what? <laughs> We gotta say that. We gotta say that now, but Yeah. But I, I swore to not lie though. Oh my you swore! Yeah, you swore! Man. You swore to bear arms! You, if they ask you, you we swore! I'm gonna get my flag. I'm gonna get oh flag. my god. <laughs> you don't have the flag, but go, I'm gonna go get, get the go flag. Get, go get. <laughs> I I got no flag. <laughs> Damn it! I, I can't believe it. Wave the flag. Wave I'm the flag. Wave the flag, America. I'm surprised they didn't let us have us memorize the the anthem though. I know, but then there's the like, oh, what's the title, right? What's the you, title? You what's Star that? Spangled Banner. There you go, Star Spangled Banner. That's very literal, like. Yeah, star I was like. Spangled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just thinking like, okay, stars, spangled. spangled. I don't know. <laughs> spangled, spangled, and then banner. Yes. All right. Uh, I was so like focused on passing the test. You know, I was like, because like the day before, I was like, like to my husband, I was like, test me, test me. Like, I gotta know all the numbers, all the names. You know, who's the chief, yeah. chief justice person now like who's the mayor of new york who's the governor oh, 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 oh. all of that governor, governor is is kathy ho cho <laughs> Whoa. ho cho and then and then the house of representative in my area is michael waller <laughs> oh my god lawler he's a lawler that's how Mr. i remember <laughs> it's like i told dentu don't worry about it, you know. I, for even for high school tests and exams, I always procrastinate, and I'm really good at short-term memory. So I'm gonna study like a couple days before, and you know, just go through it, and I'll remember. 1776 is when the Declaration of Independence was yep. written. 17, 1787 yeah. is when the Constitution was written. <laughs> so I was like. In the in the test, I was so focused on doing that, I completely forgot that you should get the flag. I was like, oh, I passed. Like, you know, I didn't even like. I was like, I could have remembered and asked, like, can I get the flag? Oh, oh my can I have the flag? Can I have the flag, please? Oh, boy, you're TK, yeah. <laughs> my goals and dreams. TK, no? <laughs> hey, you know what's funny? Like buying, uh, you know, donation, the stickers, donation, right? It's my K, my my K, uh, right? Uh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Or even like K Pew, buck up chow, K Pew. Buck up chow. Did you sound like my mom? Buck up chow. Oh it's my god, we should totally do a reel on that, like how Filipinos pronounce Cantonese words. Yes, you know what my mom says? Uh, so buck up like, chow. When I got when I have mosquito bite, my mom goes, "You put the mopiko, mopiko." 
Mon oui. béco! Mon béco! <rire> for the... Oh for Ichi. You know, it's like a Japanese brand. Oh, oh, oh. Mon béco. Oh, oh, and parfayao. Parfayao. Get the parfayao. 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 I feel like a lot of Filipinos in Hong Kong would love it. Yes, it's <laughs> It's very niche, it's, but it's like they're everywhere. It says they're all there. Yeah, that's, that's true. Oh my god, I love it. But yeah, we did so, it. It's crazy. Yeah. This is fate, guys. I think it's fate. Oh, sorry. Close enough. <laughs> close, close enough. You have faith to have faith. Fate. <laughs> fate. Nice. I like that. Fate. <laughs> that is nice. Yeah, guys, things make happen for a reason, right? Look at that. Look at this. Mm. Look at this. Who would have oh. thought? And I remember, like, you know, I feel like a lot of, a lot of, maybe a lot of people feel this too. <laughs> maybe just me. But I would grow up like, oh, I hate Americans. They're so privileged. They're always so, they're so, they're so loud. They're so obnoxious. <laughs> yeah. You know what? Like, that, I think now, thinking about it, it's because, like, all of the, mo like, all the stuff that we see of America, right? Like, mm. is the lavish. Like, the yeah, movies, yeah, yeah. obviously, That's we true. see the, the rich part, right? And the happy part. Mm -hmm. And then, like, the only time when we really see, like, America in the news is when they talk about international news, right? And uh -huh. it's not always, like, about America. You know, like, it's not, like, a long yeah. news. So yeah, it's, like, yeah, yeah. you don't really get a lot about America. Like, only now, maybe, with TikTok and Instagram, right? Like, I mean, yeah. And, yeah. and like, I follow, you know, like, a local news around my area called News 12. And then it's just, like, you know, just to keep in touch with what's happening around. And, like, almost every week I see, like, bad things happen. And they're, like, just 20 minutes away from me. And it's scary, scary especially yeah. here also. Like, and dri I don't know how people drive in America. Like, it's insane. Like, especially in the Florida road, you know. Like, apparently that that's the that's the worst highway. Oh, really? Like, especially near us, like Fort Lauderdale to here. Mm -hmm. Like, that's apparently the highest death rate in America. Like that part. Oh my and god. Okay, when I passed my driver's license, I was like, "Are you sure?" Because <laughs> it's like we were just in the. I mean, in maybe that's why. Yeah. Maybe that's why the situation there is bad because of how lenient. Yes, that's true. Because they don't even like test you in the highway at all. Like you know, you just yeah, think, yeah, okay, yeah. you're fine. Oh, interesting. And, it's like, and here it's like you don't have to go to driving school. You ask like an adult mm -hmm. to like monitor you, right? Like and and Tyler. I mean, I know how to drive, but it's like I just like kind of like did my hours and. But I never did, did the highway because I'm kind of scared still. Some people do driving school, but, you know, like, not everybody because you have to pay, right? And most people don't do it. Like, most people, just their parents teach them or older, yeah. someone older. As so. Tyler said, they even had in school. In school, they had oh, driving, like, lessons. Yeah. And I'm like, what? That's so cool. Yeah. And, but then you see, like, when you think of New York City, like, people in America, right? They're like, oh, the lavish life and stuff. But you go to New York City, it's so dirty, so mm -hmm. dirty. The, the subway, you said, I mean, I wore sandals there and my feet became black. Don't bring sandals. <laughs> Note to self. No. Don't wear sandals. I completely, bro, I'm, that's the thing I didn't know. I'm like, Florida's super sandal know, place. I like, know. everywhere we wear sandals. It's so funny. I saw, I saw, you know, when you guys came, I saw you guys like, why are you wearing sandals? I don't want to bring you to the subway because there's pee everywhere. And what if your pinky touches pee on the floor, you know? You <laughs> <laughs> so gross. Yeah. I would not want that. I will be, um, I'm drinking from a New York cup as right now, you oh. see, New York. So yeah, I will not wear sandals. I will wear shoes. Don't worry. Okay. That's how, because I, I came from New Jersey. New Jersey yeah, didn't wear yeah, sandals, yeah. no? <laughs> That's so funny. Yeah, I mean, New Jersey, if you're close to the shore, it's still like by the beach, right? Yeah, so. yeah. In Chelsea Market, June 1st, 4 o'clock to 6 p.m. in front of Pearl River Mart. There will be a little space there, and we will be there. Yes, hope and for that, sale that's there. yeah, that's when you will also come. And hopefully, you know, like if there's any event, let us know. We'll be there because, uh, you know, unfortunately, you, you couldn't make it yesterday, but you know, we can make other stuff, other contents, or like other events, and like network. Yes, so definitely. If you want 
to yes hit yeah. us up everybody if uh, you somehow have a podcast or something you know like invite us over yeah <laughs> also just wanted to thank you know joanne and christine for letting us use this space at yes. Pearl River Mart. So check them out. They have really cool stuff. Their stores, like, you know, there's a lot of like diversity, like little things that's like Cantonese and also Chinese people. So it's like really cute. So it's perfect. Perfect this for us. Perfect. Oh it's perfect for us. It's perfect for us. Hi, Yune. Hi, Yune. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. perfect. Stay tuned for Stay our tuned. awesome um, content on New York City if you are not going to be in New York City yourself. Because, uh, yeah, we will be having our first ever fan meetup. We will document it um, for yes. you, if you, especially if you can't make it. And, yeah, we're going to record our food journeys as well. A lot of new content ideas as well. Oh, yes. And we know that we have a lot of um, Hong Kong followers. We will show a little bit more about New York City, maybe even, you know, like how was life like there? And, mm -hmm. How is life as a newly an American? <laughs> we're Americans. Because that's what we are. Of course we're going to tell everybody we're Americans. <laughs> we're newly Americans. Love you guys. Thanks for listening. Thank you guys. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, our cast fans. Bye-bye. <laughs>